The Uganda Retirement Benefits Regulatory Authority, UBRA, reports that its sector performance for the year 2018 recorded a 26% growth in asset value, but with private schemes experiencing challenges of compliance on remittances. Some of your employers don't remit your funds to your schemes. And we're seriously fighting that. It is very regular. It's something we are not going to tolerate. If you've deducted members' funds, it should be remitted to the scheme account. The report also indicates that the 65 private schemes and aggregated entities under its supervision and whose collections have hit 1.8 trillion shillings to date require closer supervision. To transition from compliance-based to risk-based supervision is to do that exactly, such that we can get the red flags. We know that trustees are not making progress in the way they govern, in the way they are making investment decisions, and then we alert them, and something is done about it early enough. Because when you wait for the end, when we are saying assets increased by 20 percent, it may be late. The pension sector regulator says that with the low savings rate at 11 percent, the need for long-term savings in particular voluntary, including with the National Social Security Fund, must be fortified. So if there's any early access, it will be limited to your contribution, which is the 5 percent. So the idea is to preserve the funds to grow, to help you live a decent uh, life in retirement. Reina Ojan, NTV Business.